I'm trying to think of like, yeah, scenarios in my head where Ricky's comments, you know, are sort of um, validated. I'm like, yeah, well, what could, you know, what could be the, the reasoning? Uh, what that? happened was, mate, at training, <laughs> Ricky's son's gone for the gentleman's agreement. Yeah. Sam <laughs> slapped his hand and tackled him too hard. <laughs> <laughs> probably think back when i was younger like when the boys might have dogged me you know like one of the boys you'd tell your best mate oh, i've got a crush on the old love over here and then he runs <laughs> over and fucking tells her straight away and you're like no don't tell her don't fucking tell her <laughs> oh no, i only said that as a joke <laughs> <laughs> jake wants you to be his valentine i didn't fucking say that <laughs> i didn't say that you're a weak kind of dog <laughs> Put yourself in a 10-year-old's shoes. What would you have to do to be labelled a weak at a dog? Boy, let's say Ricky, Jamin and Salmon, 10 years old. Let's just say Ricky, benefit of the doubt, 45 maybe? Mm. Mid-40s and he's 40 somewhere? What do you have yeah. to do at the age of 10? This is to listeners. What would you have to do at the age of 10 to be labelled a weak at a dog by a 45-year-old man? 